Evolution of Computer The Mechanical Era The time duration between 1642 AD to 1890 AD was known as Mechanical Era. Abacus, Napier Bone, Slide Rule, Pascaline, Charles Babbage, Tabulating Machine, Boolean Algebra. The Electromechanical Era the time duration between 1890 AD to 1945 AD was known as Electromechanical Era, Mark I Computer, Atanasoff Berry Computer, Colossus. The Electronic Era The time duration between 1945 AD to present are known as Electronic Era. ENIAC, EDVAC, EDSAC, UNIVAC Generation of Computer A step-by-step -step development and history of computer on the basis of size, speed, operation system, storage etc. is known as Generation of Computer. Or Generation in computer terminology is a change in technology a computer is slash was being used. Initially, the generation term was used to distinguish between varying hardware technologies. Nowadays, Generation includes both hardware and software, which together make up an entire computer system. Types of Generation in Computer First Generation Computers Second Generation Computers Third Generation Computers Fourth Generation Computers Fifth Generation Computers first generation of computers. The time duration between 1940 AD to 1956 AD is known as first generation of computer. These computers use the vacuum tubes technology for calculation as well as for storage and control purposes. Examples, ENIAC, EDVAC, EDSAC, UNIVAC etc. Features of first generation of computers Main electronic component, vacuum tube Main memory, magnetic drums and magnetic tapes Programming language, machine language Power, consume a lot of electricity and generate a lot of heat Processing speed, milliseconds Advantages of first generation of computers It was used mostly for scientific applications. Only vacuum tubes were used in these generation computers. These generation's computers were simple architecture. Facility for storing information Disadvantages of first generation of computers they heated very soon due to thousands of vacuum tubes. They were not very reliable. Constant maintenance was required. Not portable. Costly commercial production. Second generation of computers. The time frame between 1957 AD to 1964 AD is known as second generation of computer. The main characteristics of these computers were the use of transistors in the place of vacuum tubes and building the basic logic circuits. Examples, IBM 1401, IBM 1920, etc. Features of second generation of computers Main electronic component, transistor Memory, magnetic core and magnetic tape slash disk Programming language, assembly language Power and size, low power consumption, generated less heat, and smaller in size, in comparison with the first generation computers Processing speed, microseconds
Advantages of Second Generation of Computers Smaller in size as compared to the first generation computer. Second generation computers were more reliable. Used less energy and were not heated as much as a first generation computer. Wider commercial use. Better speed and could calculate data in microseconds. Disadvantages of second generation of computers. As we know, that they generate less heat but still require a cooling system. They require frequent maintenance. The commercial production of second generation computers is difficult. They are used only for some specific purpose. They use punch cards for input. Third generation of computers. The time frame between 1965 AD to 1972 AD is known as third generation of computer. The major characteristics or feature of third generation computer systems was the use of integrated circuits, ICs. Examples, CDC 1700, IBM 360 series, etc. Features of third generation of computers. Main electronic component, integrated circuits, IC. Memory, large magnetic core and magnetic tape slash disk. Programming language, high level language. Power and size, low power consumption, generated less heat, and smaller in size, in comparison with the second generation computers. Processing speed, picoseconds. Advantages of third generation of computers. The size of computers reduced. Faster processing and less computational time. Less electricity consumption. Increased storage capacity of computer. Increased accuracy. Disadvantages of third generation of computers. Air conditioning required in the mainframes but not in many computers. The price of computers very costly. Integrated circuits could not be repaired easily. Integrated circuits were very complicated and required specialized workers. Sophisticated technology required to manufacture integrated circuits. Fourth generation of computers. The time duration between 1972 AD to present is known as fourth generation of computer. The invention of large scale integration, LSI, technology and very large scale integration, VLSI, technology led to the development of fourth generation computers. However, these computers still use the IC technology to build the basic circuits. Examples, IBM 4341, December 10, Star 1000 and PUP 11. Features of fourth generation of computers. Main electronic component, very large scale integration, VLSI, and microprocessor. VLSI, thousands of transistors on a single microchip. Memory, semiconductor memory, such as RAM, ROM, etc. Programming language, high-level language, Python, C Sharp, Java, JavaScript. Processing speed, nanoseconds. Advantages of fourth generation of computers. They were developed for totally general purpose use, general purpose computers. Portable and cheaper than the older versions. Fourth generation computers were much faster than the older generations. Less repair time and maintenance cost. They were developed for commercial production as well.
disadvantages fourth generation of computers. Very advanced technology was required to fabricate the ICs, integrated circuits. A high quality and reliable system or technology can only make the ICs. Cooler is required, fan. The latest technology is required for the manufacturing of microprocessors. Fifth Generation of Computers Fifth Generation Computers are in developmental stage which is based on the artificial intelligence. The goal of the fifth generation is to develop the device which could respond to natural language input and are capable of learning and self-organization. Quantum computation and molecular and nanotechnology will be used in this technology. Features of fifth generation of computers ULSI technology Development of true artificial intelligence. Development of natural language processing. More user-friendly interfaces with multimedia features. They are the fastest and powerful computers till date. Advantages of fifth generation of computers. The ability to understand human language. The ability to recognize graphs and images. The ability to self-organize itself. Self-learning abilities. Thinking more logically resulting in taking wiser decisions on its own to solve everyday problems. Disadvantages of fifth generation of computers. Fear of unemployment taking over the world, spying on people, 